I decided to take on AI in a photographic challenge. That was a good idea. For this photographic challenge, I allowed myself 10 minutes to take a picture of a very small Yorkshire Terrier and then ask the AI to create something similar. Any of you who have taken pictures of a dog will know it's very difficult to capture a sharp image as they run towards you because of the way cameras work. So I thought, why not? 10 minutes, easy. So first up, here is our little Yorkshire Terrier. Slightly wonky teeth, just shaved. Not necessarily the most pretty thing right now. Versus the AI. My next challenge was to get our dog to put its leg like this and do a pose that Yorkshire Terriers do. And here's the result. Now the AI didn't quite understand the request, even though I said only raise one paw, and it did this. So for the first one, the lighting conditions were very hard. There was a direct sunlight coming in, and I couldn't create that cinematic look that AI could create. The AI one looks much better, although it's a tiny bit creepy, bit too cute to the dog. But when it comes to detail, you can see there's a massive difference in the images. And lastly, I decided to compare an image that I took at the beach Again, this wasn't set up, it was a spontaneous picture of the dog while she was sat waiting for a treat. So what are the chances of my photography career going forward now? Because AI, well, did it do better? I don't know, you comment below. The AI models are developing so fast that it's becoming a bit scary and I will do a separate video on that. But there you have it, bye bye photography career. If you've challenged AI or tried to compare some of your images with its and what it comes up with, let me know in the comments.